friends, Sasha here from The Little Log Retreat, owner and creator of The Little Log Retreat and TheLittleLogRetreat.com. Hello, today is July 3rd and we are prepping for July 4th, which is so exciting. But if you have a dog at home, or a cat for that matter, who suffers from the scary, uh, anxiety prone moments from fireworks on holidays such as the 4th or New Year's, I have a cute, quick, Ha uh, hack or trick for you to try at home. Um, if you have a mesh, this is a um, just a, in your emergency kit. This is basically a tourniquet kind of a thing. You just wrap it around your arm. If you have anything like this at home, grab it. You can also use uh, tights, not like nylons, the thin ones, but tights that are thicker. You're going to take it and instead of wrapping it around uh, a wound in this case, you're going to wrap it around your dog and I'm going to show you how. So right now we have Haley. <laughs> Haley's right here. Now Haley does get nervous during, uh, during uh, fireworks and whatnot. So I'm going to show you how I go ahead and would wrap her. Now most of the time she's fine as long as she's held or she's around us. But if, she's, if you're going to be going out or whatnot, you're basically going to take it, stretch it out, wrap it around their belly first, secure it safely underneath, give it about two wraps underneath their, their chest, their girth. Go ahead and wrap it. Wrap it a second time. Make sure it's not too tight. You're gonna be able to still pull a little bit of a little bit of it up, put your fingers underneath, it's gonna be okay. Wrap it around a third time. Take the excess and you're gonna go kind of like a like a seat belt type, sort of across like a seat belt or like a wrap purse, something like that. Wrap it just right across in between their arms and then secure it safely. Now this is not gonna make them feel stuck. Instead what this is gonna do is make them feel like they're being held even if they're not being held. So if you're gonna be out for either a barbecue time or you're gonna be out in the evening enjoying a fireworks show or you're gonna be, let's say, in your backyard, your dogs are gonna be inside, this will help them feel like they're already being held and hugged like a thunder shirt would. But if you don't have a thunder shirt or you don't wanna buy a thunder shirt and you just need it every once in a while as a quick remedy, this will be perfect. You can get these at pretty much anywhere, at like a drugstore, Rite Aid, pharmacy type place, um, Walgreens, you know, if you had time to order, you could always order from Amazon, um, Target, anywhere else is gonna have this. And this is basically anything that would go in on a first aid kit and it's just the bandage itself. Now this is a standard one. So here's, here's what mine looks like right now. It just was wrapped three times around her. So Haley's about nine pounds. Uh, so she's pretty small. If you have a larger dog, you probably only wrap around twice. You can also buy two and get them and, you know, kind of connect them and wrap them around if you have a really large, like big dog. And so you're just gonna wrap it around that way. And then again, the excess is gonna come across like a seatbelt would, across diagonally from their back around between their arms and then connect that strap, that little Velcro strap, go ahead and connect it underneath. And this will make them feel like they're being held and they won't be as scared of the thunder. Just like if a mama dog was just sit on her pup and let them know that they're safe and okay, or if you were gonna hold your dog and let them know that you're they're safe and okay, just go ahead and try this out. It's a super fast remedy, different, um, super quick hack you could do at home, and I hope it works out. Have a wonderful, safe 4th of July, and we will see you soon. Thanks, <laughs> bye.